Hi, for this video what we're going to do is we're going to solve a linear inequality. Um, this particular one has no solution. You would not realize that just looking at it, so you do have to solve it. Um, but I did want you to be able to see how you recognize when there is no solution to the linear inequality. So with this, what we're going to do is we're going to treat this very much like we would a linear equation. And what we want to do is we want to simplify both sides. The left hand side, there is nothing that I can do to it. There are no like terms, so I'm just going to leave it as is for now. For this one, um, there is a common mistake that I see. A lot of times I see students, they try to add these before distributing. Um, don't do that because remember that multiplication is more important than addition. So you want to make sure that you distribute the four first um, and then combine like terms. So we would just distribute this positive four into the x and the negative 8. Make sure that if this was negative that you watch signs. Be very careful about that. Um, so we would have positive 4x and then positive 4 times negative 8 um, gives us negative 32. And then what we need to do is we need to simplify both sides. So I have negative 39 plus 4x is greater than, and I'm going to add these two together. Since they're both negatives, we add them and we keep the sign. So we would have 4x minus 37. Since we have variables on both sides, remember that our goal is to get a variable by itself. So I'm going to go ahead and bring my x's to the same side. And when you, I do that, if you notice, my variable term cancels out. And I'm left with this statement, negative 39 is greater than negative 37. And if you think about this on a number line, if 0 is here, and negative 37 is down here. Negative 39 is never going to be greater than that. Negative 39 is always to the left of that. It's never going to be to the right of that. Um, so since this is an untrue statement or a false statement, um, we would say that there is no real solution or there is no solution to this equation. As far as the graph goes, you would just leave an empty number line like this. You can't shade anything because there is no solution. Um, if you're dealing with set notation, you would just say that it's an empty set. So for this one, there is no solution because of the fact that negative 39 is never going to be greater than negative 37. So no matter what number I plug into here, I'm going to end up with an untrue statement. So if it was a true statement, then it's all reals if your variables cancel out. If it's an untrue or a false statement, um, then there is no solution. As always, thanks for watching. Um, if there are any videos that you need me to make, topics that you need me to cover, just please let me know.